welcome back to my channel so today's video is a cooking video so recently uh, all of you know we are going through a tough time we are all quarantined in our uh, house and we are all staying at our house so we are all doing things which we enjoy and which we don't get the time to do usually so i have also started cooking because i really love and enjoy cooking but i don't get the time to cook all the time so today uh, i this video is about a recipe which i recently visited bangladesh actually and it's a recipe which I actually had tasted over there it's the chicken bhuna khichri recipe and I really wanted to try it since then but then I did not get the time so now uh, during this uh, quarantine period I got the chance and I have made a chick boneless chicken bhuna khichri so uh, I have vlogged throughout and I will be giving you all the ingredients which is required and step by step method I have showed you uh, in this vlog we'll of course see it after this so so this video is a cooking video and um, this video is about a recipe which uh, is known as the boneless chicken bhuna khichri recipe so please enjoy this uh, video guys and i have mentioned every ingredient the, the proper quantity and everything in the description box below guys so please do refer to it for the proper uh, ingredients but otherwise i've showed it in the video also so yeah uh, do refer to the description box for the proper uh, measurements and uh, please enjoy this video guys uh, i got a very positive feedback from my family because everyone loved it so i hope if you make this uh, chicken bhuna khichri in your house uh, i'm sure you will get you will get a lot of praises so yeah uh, without talking much let's get started with the video So this is basmati rice which I have soaked in water. This is masoor dal which I have soaked in water. And this is uh, moong dal which I have roasted and then I have soaked it in water. And this is the chicken. Coming to this, this these are bay leaves. These are uh, cinnamon sticks. These are cardamoms. These are cloves. This is some ginger paste. Uh, this is some garlic paste, and these are some green chili. So these are the spices. Uh, here there is some turmeric powder, some red chili powder, some coriander powder, some salt, and some cumin powder. So these are some sliced onions. This is the size of the spoon, and I have taken ten tablespoons of oil. This is garam masala powder. So these are some fried onions uh, which will be required later on. And some ghee. Now I am pouring the oil uh, in the karhai. Then I am adding all the spices like uh, the bay leaves, cardamom, cinnamon and all that. So I am adding them one by one. So uh, after stirring a bit I am adding the sliced onions and I am going to stir uh, again until the onions uh, turn golden brownish. After that, I'm adding the ginger paste and the garlic paste and again, I'm going to stir it. Then I'm adding all the powders. So the coriander powder, the turmeric powder, the cumin powder and the red chili powder and then I'm going to stir again. Then I'm just adding a little bit of water to it. And uh, mixing it well after this I'm gonna add the chicken uh, in this uh, masala and I'm gonna mix it well Then I'm going to add the salt and mix it and then I'm going to keep frying the chicken until it turns goldenish brown. So after this I'm going to add some water and cover it with the lid so that the chicken gets cooked. 
after the chicken is cooked i'm just going to take out the chicken and keep it in a separate plate and this is how it looks after it's uh, well cooked and i'm going to keep the masala in the pan itself because i'm going to add the rice in the same masala so now i am adding the basmati rice which i had soaked in the water so i've drained out the water and i'm just adding the rice same way i am adding the lentils so i am adding the two different lentils one by one and uh, i just added the masoor dal and uh, sorry the mook dal and now i am adding the masoor dal so after adding the rice and the lentils in the masala i am going to mix it well after mixing it well i am adding some hot water to it and then i am going to add some salt also i am going to mix it well and then i am going to let it cook for some time Once the rice is cooked, we are adding the chicken which we had taken out that time, and we are going to mix it well. Now I am adding the green chilies, which I had shown you earlier. Now I am adding the fried onions. Now I have added the garam masala powder, and finally I am adding the ghee. and then i'm covering it for the final time so that everything cooks properly and ta da it is ready chicken boneless uh, buna khichdi is ready guys and this is how it looks to enhance the taste you can have this with lemon and yeah this is how it looks it tastes yum guys so you guys should definitely try it This was it guys I hope you like this video do give a thumbs up if you do so also comment down below how did you like it and when are you going to try this recipe also let me know guys in the comment section that uh, if you want more of such cooking videos because I am cooking a lot these days so I will be very happy if you want more of such cooking videos I will vlog then and uh, also share it with your friends and family so that everyone comes to know about this recipe i'm sure many of you already know but those who don't know they can come uh, across this recipe so do share it with your friends and family guys do give a thumbs up if you like this video and also comment down below when are you planning to do this recipe and if you want more of such cooking videos or not also subscribe to my channel if you still haven't thank you for watching guys bye bye